Can we talk about anger? Like really getting mad. Are we allowed to do that? And furthermore, did Jesus get angry? Like really angry? Stop making my father's house a marketplace. I'm pretty sure he was angry. There's a lot of verses in the Bible that tell us that it's not a good idea to be angry. But this is one verse that says something just a teeny bit different. I don't want to tell you guys. Be angry and sin not. So obviously in those clips earlier, we saw that Jesus got really angry or mad or whatever version of that word you want to say. But he didn't sin. In many circumstances, we could easily get angry. But some other verses in the Bible say, overcome evil with good. You can get angry, like really angry, obviously like Jesus did. But if you ever get mad, Choose not to sin. So don't end up starting to go off and saying a whole bunch of bad words and getting off into some tantrum and saying a whole bunch of stuff that you regret. You can get angry, but use that anger to provoke you to do something right and to do something about that situation that will turn it around for good. Before we leave that other verse, I want to say something. It says, do not let the sun go down on your anger. Sun's going down, so I better not be angry. Don't carry hurt and grudge on throughout the day. Forgive, because the Bible says, so if you do not forgive others their trespasses, God will not forgive yours either. Paraphrasing a Bible verse in chapter five. So if you don't want to be forgiven, well then go ahead. But I wouldn't recommend that because people who are not forgiven of their sins go to hell. And you don't want that. And I don't want that either. Forgive, don't hold those grudges. There's some other verse in the Bible that says, refrain from anger and forsake wrath, which is another word for anger. An old version, like back in the old days, don't be full of wrath. Don't lose your temper. It leads only to harm. How does these two verses go together? Righteous anger against evil is fine. Anger against things that we're not supposed to be angry about is what leads to tons and tons of harm and destruction in people's lives. If you've had times where you dealt with so much anger and you have a lot of these anger issues, when you're getting angry, you're actually doing things that you shouldn't do. Ask God to help. Ask him to, to help you with self-control. It's one of the fruits of the Spirit that is in you. When you have the Holy Spirit, you have self-control. Since the Holy Spirit is in you, you can ask Jesus, Jesus, help me choose self-control in this situation because the Holy Spirit's in you and so that's how we're supposed to live with self-control and not getting angry like this. Ah!